Good morning, everyone. It's Anifa Menon from HeartHealthBrainHealth.com, encouraging healthy grieving and mindful actions. Today is International Women's Day, so happy International Women's Day. So, of course, I would have a quote about women today to share with you, and I loved this quote, which is by G.D. Anderson. The quotation says, Feminism isn't about making women strong. Women are already strong. It's about changing the way the world perceives that strength. Yes. Feminism isn't about making women strong. Women are already strong. It's about changing the way the world perceives that strength. Now, some of you might know that I'm very much into conscious evolution and we're certainly evolving both individually and collectively. So this perception of women's strength, I thought today I would talk to you a little bit about how Chinese medicine looks at energies. And you might have heard the terms yin and yang, and yin is more feminine and yang is more masculine. And when I think about yin and yang energies, the things that we often relate to feminine or yin energies are things that are about a stability, um, a kindness, a peace, um, a cool energy. When we think about yang, we think of a heated energy, a movement energy, a strong uh, energy. Now, of course, when some people would think strong, then they would think that, oh, well, then the yin energy must be weak. And no, I will say that strong in terms of uh, physical strength or strong in terms of a driven energy is more yang or more masculine energy. And uh, strong in terms of, you might know that it takes a lot of strength to maintain peace in a time of conflict. So whether it's within a family or within a country or whether it's within the self, this takes a strong yin energy. I wanted to make sure that everyone also knows that all of us, men and women, have yin and yang energies. And all of us have varying quantities of these at any time. So you might know a lot of women that have a lot of yang energy. So they're driven and they're perhaps aggressive and they're go, go, go. And that sort of energy is known as a masculine energy. But of course, a lot of women do show this. And then there's the yin energy, which is a little bit more settled and nurturing and kind and um, stable and peaceful. And that energy is a yin energy, which is in both men and women. And I think it's so important for us to recognize this, that as our conscious evolution in our world is expanding to create more evenness, to more um, peaceful interactions between men and women or people and people, we recognize these yin and yang energies are playing out in everything. And we see a lot of strength in women. We also see a lot of nurturing in men. So again, strength in both ways, right? So women can be aggressive and women can be nurturing. Men can be aggressive and men can be nurturing. And we all have both. We all have both. And so when I think of International Women's Day, I also want to include the men who have more strong qualities of these feminine energies. And we're moving from what's known as 3D to 5D consciousness. I will definitely post a link for my latest, uh, well, one of my newsletters that actually talks about this shift in consciousness. This shift in consciousness is pulling us back into a feminine energy overall, um, more accepting, more welcoming, more working together rather than individual growth. And I love this idea. So I think that International Women's Day today is for all of us to get in touch with our feminine energies, our feminine yin energies, and to recognize how powerful those energies really are. Today, I'll leave you with one more quote, which is by Audrey Hepburn. And Audrey Hepburn says, the true beauty in a woman is reflected in her soul. The true beauty of a woman is reflected in her soul. And don't forget that we all have a soul. So this female beauty that we feel and recognize and value and honor and cherish today and hopefully every day is within all of us. It is that peaceful nurturing. It is love. It is peace. It is compassion. And it is within all of us. So happy International Women's Day 
celebrate your yin energies today. Have a fabulous day, everyone. And remember, transform your mind and transform your life.